The Owabi Sanctuary is the first Ramsia site, the only inland wetland in Ghana. The reconstruction of the flood prone Atafwa Bridge, contractors say, will affect the Atafwa Wildlife Camp and the 2,000 mahogany and framo trees grown and nurtured over seven years ago to protect the dam. Majority of these economically viable trees you see here, about 2,000 of them are the mahogany and framo species grown and nurtured for over seven years by the wildlife sanctuary protecting the Owabi Dam. Now this was specific but then all these trees are going to be uprooted and destroyed from today and tomorrow and that destruction has started from the bridge over there. The contractor moved in on Friday and started destroying the economic trees and moved towards the demolition of the camp building. But the wildlife personnel resisted the move, demanding official communication from local authorities to management of the sanctuary. <laughs> They have not informed our management and we cannot allow them to destroy the trees without any communication. Chief Resource Guide of the Owabi Wildlife Division of the Forestry Commission, Yakubu Noga, tells Love News the move will affect their stay and years of afforestation. Our main worry is the destruction of these valuable trees nurtured over the years by afforestation personnel. Growing these trees came with a huge cost and the nation is yet to benefit from them. If they destroy our camp, where are we going to stay to protect the dam? Management of Nat Fermos Construction Limited will not speak with Love News. But a letter written by the Regional Highways Authority dated 10th February 2023 notified the Division of the Rehabilitation of the Abrepo Junction Barakese Offensu Road. Reporting for Joy News, Erastus Asaridonko Kumasi.